Look at all of these beautiful poinsettias. Uh, Kendall Marin from Bell Nurseries is here to tell us how to care for them and what's out there on the market these days. Thanks so much for coming in. Thanks. Thanks for and having me. Like the official nursery for the Home Depot. We are. We sell exclusively to Home Depot in seven states, including Maryland, Virginia, and the district. All right. Well, let's see. Let's talk about what we have over here. Uh, I think we may need to start over here. What is, what is this particular? That is Ruby Frost. Mm -hmm. It's a new variety. We've tried about 20 new varieties this year. Wow. Uh, see how they perform and what people are really into mm -hmm. and what we're going to grow again next year. So that's one of our new ones. Mm -hmm. uh, the one next to it is the Marbella, which has also been very popular. This one? Mm hmm And so is it, a, um, is it because of the colors that are involved? Yeah. Each, each one is bred to have a different um, combination of colors mm -hmm. or striking single color, mm -hmm. uh, which is how they ended up with that white ruffle around the edges That's of that. That's beautiful. And this, this one's sort of pink or yeah, salmon? Yeah. It's really a standard pink, and we've, we've added some sparkle just to give it a little holiday flair. Mm -hmm. That one's a great gift idea. And these cute little, um, little, little potted ones. Yeah. We call them the mini poinsettias, mm -hmm. and they're two-inch pots. Uh, those are obviously reusable containers next year and a poinsettia you can enjoy for the next couple of months. Really? I mean, they just, they are bred as many poinsettias? Yeah, I mean, if you had the right conditions and really wanted oh. to be aggressive, you could continue to grow it. But okay. All right. And then we year? have the, 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 these red ones, traditional. Yeah, this is um, actually a newer one this year, too. Oh. This is called a firecracker, which is a little bit more orange than mm -hmm. your traditional red. Mm -hmm. And you can really see that next to this uh, Merlot here, which is more of a burgundy color, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, which then again contrasts with our traditional okay, Freedom so Red. Okay, that's the traditional. Yeah, this okay. is the real traditional poinsettia that most people are going to be looking for when they're um, shopping for poinsettias. Oh, I need to bring this one over. Okay. This one is gorgeous. This is, oh. Which variety is this one? That is Freedom White. Okay. Same kind of combination or um, genetics as the Freedom Red, mm -hmm. but just in a white. Okay. Uh, again, a very hiding. popular, very sturdy alternative. And, and can we see this one over here in the corner? This this tree. I mean, you have a lot of tree varieties. Mm -hmm, but this we do. One with the the, the white colors. glitter, I think, is the one you like that yes. has the red and the white. Can you see that one right there over the, the tree here, Norris? Beautiful. That was new a few years ago and um, has become very popular. Lovely. All right. Let's talk a little bit about how you care for these. Um, one is, you say, remove the protective sleeve. Yes. Once you get the plant home, the protective sleeve is really a nice thing to have mm -hmm. on it because um, it keeps it protected until you get it home. Right. They are somewhat delicate. So once you get it home, you take down the sleeve, mm -hmm. uh, let it breathe, and then when you water it, you want to take it out of its tin. Water the pot, let the water drain through. You don't want it to leave it standing in water, oh. and then put it back. They like to be a little bit moist, mm -hmm. but not soggy by any means. And don't put it in the direct sunlight? No, not direct sunlight. They like a little bit of filtered light. Mm -hmm. They can take some light, but um, don't, don't want anything direct. What about heat and cold air? Definitely I mean. not a good partnership. <laughs> um, heat, heat vents and cold drafts, neither one are good. So you want to keep it away from a door frequently and um, away from your heating vents. Well, I don't know where to put it. Any <laughs> idea? Uh, the dining room table is a perfect <laughs> location. Um, right. Yeah, but just about anywhere, just you're, as long as you're away from those. And I know that's, this sounds silly, but you said remove the protective sleeve. I always left it on thinking, oh, it's part of the decoration. <laughs> well, this part is part of the decoration, but the plastic, the plastic that comes up know, around it. Plastic. So what, when, they, when the leaves start falling, everything starts falling, is there any help? hope for it? Um, there is. You can nurse them back to health, but we really sell them as a seasonal plant. They're okay. they're temperamental if you want to try and keep them throughout mm -hmm. the year, but um, okay. really just enjoy it for the season. All right, great. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. Beautiful flowers. Thank you very Down much. Nursery. Don't go away. We have answers.